as much as it is frustrating not to be able to show the work you've done under NDA, don't treat NDAs lightly. NDAs stand for non-disclosure agreements, and they are usually signed between two parties so they can work together on confidential things, maybe a project or anything involving trade secrets. Sometimes it's also to protect the client's client's information and corporate strategy. In design, you may typically be asked to sign an NDA before working on a product or even at the interview stage. I have sometimes seen case studies with surprising levels of information regarding things that would usually fall under an NDA agreement. And as an employer or future employer, this is definitely a red flag. How can I trust the person to respect the confidentiality of my projects if they do it with their former employers? Even if you put this work behind a password or send it only when applying, you are still sharing something that should have not been shared in the first place. So what can you do about it? First, discuss with your employers and clients. Many understand the needs of being able to show the design work done, and there is usually room for negotiation. It can be, for example, taking off the company's logo and any mention of its name, or maybe replicating a screen without using the design systems. If the company read does not authorize you to show the work, you can still mention that you worked for them, but that the work is under in the air. It doesn't prevent you, by the way, to talk about what you learned while doing the job. For example, that you learn how to use a design system in a very short period of time, and you can do this without talking about any specificities of the project itself. 